never in a million years did I think that I would really enjoy outdoor cooking on this cob. Absolutely adore it, let me tell you. And today, we're gonna cook something that we've never done before. I'm gonna attempt, well, I'll be the main chef, obviously. The sous chef, is it? We're gonna make a steak and ale pie on the cob, using a cobblestone, one of these things, but we're gonna do it with a little twist. So the way I figure this is gonna work, whoops, everything's falling down here, so bear with me a sec. Sorry. Basically what we're gonna try and do, whether this is gonna work or not, I honestly don't know. Main cob here, cobblestone in, and this lovely new pan that we bought. I'm gonna stick some lamb, was it beef? No, some beef, some onions, some carrots, some bits and bobs. Cook it and reduce it down in this with a nice doom bar for the steak and ale bit. And then I'm gonna add a secret ingredient. And uh, then once we've got it all bubbling away, it's gonna bubble away in here for an hour or so, I guess. I don't know, I guess. Then we're gonna take this off. We're gonna stick the hot plate on. Then we're gonna stick the roasting thing on, however that goes, and then we're gonna put it all in a pie tin with some pastry and stuff on it and cook it off in direct heat and see how that goes. Have you guessed what the secret ingredient's gonna be? You'll never guess, but I think it might be a huge revelation to the world. Huge revelation to the world, I say. Right, I'm gonna start preparing myself getting everything ready. Lee's going to help me, so we need people to potatoes. Need to peel some potatoes, dice some onions up, get some um, mongi carrots that we've got from the allotment, cut all them up, and get this going. I'm so excited. I never thought we'd be doing cooking vlogs. <laughs> anyway, see you in a minute. We're going to cook with some new utensils. I, I think I showed you this on a previous vlog. A little... Um, fire maple bag with some bits in it basically let's get them out shall we so we've got some tongs which we are not going to need today well we might do i don't who knows whether we'll need some tongs these are great because they just fold out so those we've got a ladle which we are going to need so a bit of stirry oops a daisy i tell you and then here we have a little fry thing so that's all good we'll be using those comes also with a little cutting mat let's undo that i'm not sure we'll use this we might need something bigger because this is an industrial pie we're making and then inside here we have some rock salt which we will be using and we have some everyday spice which we'll probably use as well and we have a little oil thing so it's a great little kit to be honest yeah let's see how we got on with this shall we boys and girls hello <laughs> well we won't bore you with the chopping of onions and chopping of potatoes and peeling potatoes etc etc so we'll speed <laughs> and then we'll go on to the interesting bit when we get there bye <laughs> this is the interesting bit This ain't going in there. Yeah, I like it how it's one of mine. Lee's beer. beer is going in there. Yeah. <laughs> it's Lee's beer because she drinks Doom Bar. Ooh, happy days, I say happy days. It's time to light the old um, cob. These are made of coconut. I don't know whether I've told you that before. Probably have. But once this is lit, oh, it's, it's such a shit lighter, honestly. Oh dear. Should we try again in a minute? <laughs> there we are then. That'll probably sort it. There we go. We've got it lit now. Take about five or six minutes before that's ready to cook. See you in four or five minutes or ten or nine. Who knows? Bye. Here's some more disfigured carrots. 
from uh, the allotment. Oh, his penis is right over to one side, isn't it? Look. He's definitely a left hanger, isn't he? Ooh, loo, 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 loo. Don't be grim. <laughs> but, uh, oh, huh. Says her. <laughs> Don't be grim. Get a bit of oil in there. Decent bit. And then what we're going to do, we're going to add the beef. Okay, now you're probably not going to get too much of a sizzle because I want these to cook fairly slowly to start off with. So I don't want to just go mad with it. There's a little bit of a sizzle, so fair play. We just want to seal it, to be honest. We'll stick the old uh, onions in it with a min in a minute. That's good. Get them coated in oil. Oh, look at that already. Fabulous. I'm going to bung the onions in as well now. So bear with me. If the lady of the boat could just um, stick those in. I said I didn't want this ridiculously hot to start off with because we just want to get this going gently. What I intend to do, I, say, I don't know what I'm doing, I have to be honest with you, but what we want to do is get this cooking nice and slowly and get it, keep it nice and moist. Once this is sealed, we'll start adding beer, we'll start adding stock, and then just see what happens really. We want it just to bubble away for an hour or so, and then make the pie afterwards, if you know what I mean. Let's see what happens. Let's stick the old lid on and we'll leave that for a bit. Well, I kind of thought while well, um, dinner is cooking, because it's going to be a while, I'll just show you this little sign and have a guess what? The marina are advertising for a marina operative. So I guess that means a little prefect. And have a guess what? I could apply for that, can I? Just have it for a week or so, because then guess what I could do? Guess what I could do? I could come along here and say, move your car, move your car, move your car, move your car. <laughs> I tell you. Well, to be fair, I actually think this is going really well because I didn't want this to brown too quickly or anything. I wanted it to be fairly slow. So this is a good heat to be cooking on. It's going to take a while, but we don't mind. We've got beer and stuff, so we'll be happy. It smells really quite nice already. There's a lot of moisture in there. And I'm not being funny, right? You can't really beat being moist on a Sunday. That's what I reckon anyway. I think Lee agrees. She got moist this morning. because she went paddle boarding. <laughs> Lee, what are you actually doing? I'm trying to string these runner beans, but I think because they're um, mutant runner beans, they're not nice and straight. They just don't go through the thing. Oh, now that one's stuck. <laughs> oh dear, but no one likes them anyway, oh, Lee. They do. Hmm. Takes the edges off and then look, makes them into nice thin things. See, the knife works so much better, doesn't it? <laughs> Sometimes simple is better. Lee knows I'm simple and she says I'm better. <laughs> A bit of salt to it now, everybody. Healthy salt. I said I wasn't going to use my tongs, didn't I? But they've come in handy, I say. I think these are nice for skin glitting it around. Right, I've done the stock, which is one beef oxo, one chicken oxo, and some gravy granules. So it's a bit thicker than you would normally have it, but then obviously we're going to water it down with the, the beer. Excellent. But we can always put more gravy granules in. If it's too thin, because then that will just thicken them up again. 
I think perhaps I think perhaps the beer should be put in here now as well. Because we're gonna add the spuds. I think there's too many carrots to be fair. We ain't gonna get all that in there. So Lee's gonna add some doom bar. Oh look at this. A precious doom bar. Yeah. Look at that, girls and boys. Now we're going to add the potatoes as well. And I guess we might as well put the carrots in. And we're going to let this bubble away for a, a good hour. She's definitely cooked too many, uh, done too many carrots. That's pie. enough. Honestly, no, that's enough. We're not doing carrot pie. <laughs> anyway, put lid on. Ooh, where's the lid? And we'll see what happens. We'll get back to you in maybe half an hour, three quarters of an hour, and see how we're getting on. It's dripping, let me tell you. Shall I put the camera up and show you everybody? Or shall I just lift the lid? Look at that. Oh, oh, that's looking good, isn't it? I think it's time to add some secret ingredients that are not so secret because I'm showing you. <laughs> Paul's now going to add the secret ingredient. That's not secret anyway. He's going to say the not so secret oh, ingredient. That. That's fabulous, isn't it? Mm. Lee, what's this? Dynamite chili marmite. Limited edition. We're going to add a nice spoonful Dollop. now. It, you know, it, it just sticks to it, doesn't it? How, how's that supposed to come off, Lee? Look. Put it into the juice. Oh, but I like seeing it. Wiggle it, it around. Look at that. <laughs> just give it a little bit of a woohoo, I say. <laughs> I'll just taste a little bit of that. Gonna put it on me, Lee? <laughs> Can you see me? Yes. Oh, wow. No, seriously. <laughs> Don't eat any more. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Even if you do say so yourself. No, that's good. Splendid. You might need to taste it, Lee. Give me okay. the camera and let's see what you think. I'm not <laughs> even joking. <laughs> it's very hot, darling. No. Oh. Mm. You can mm. taste it, can't you? Mm. Very lovely. I'm telling you. It's going to be the most amazing pie ever. Even better than Lee's cream pie. We're now an hour in, and both Lee and I have had a little taste of this, and oh my God. I don't like to blow my own trumpet, but oh, it tastes so good. Honestly. It tastes so blooming good. Lee is now going to sort out the pastry and stuff. And uh, we'll put this in the pie and see what happens. But the potatoes are fairly soft. The um, carrots are a little bit al dente, but that's cool. Carrots do take a long time to cook, you know. The meat is spot on. Another 10 minutes in here, and then we'll be sticking it in a pie thing. We're getting very close now. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to add... Some more of this. Secret ingredient. Marmite. No, it's not normal marmite. Look what it says. <laughs> Here we go. Look at this. It's reduced down well now, to be fair. Definitely ready for the pie. 
or for the pastry I should say and Lee's going to take over for this bit shouldn't really be doing it with this spoon but hey there we go okay here's the weird bit I'm going to take this off now um, let me just move this. You can't see what I'm doing, but it doesn't matter. I'm going to take this off. Our cobblestone's doing well still. Let's put it down for a moment. I'm going to put this plate on here. We're going to also now put the, um, the roasting pan on. I'm just going to stick this on top for a moment. Ollie's sorting herself out. He's going to roll the pastry and we're going to stick that in a pie. Woo -hoo -hoo. Right, I'm just going to um, roll this out. We'll probably get away with only using a bit of it, so we've got some left for something else. Splendid. Right, and then we've got to, I've got my milk and my pastry brush to go on the top. I've got a jug for the extra gravy. So I'm going to have to ladle it into this pie dish. Oh, I should have bought um, a spoon with a hole in it because then sometimes you get like too much gravy, but then you can save the gravy. If only you guys could smell this, <laughs> I tell you. you. That's smelly vision. Oh. Lee, have I excelled myself? You have. Let's be honest, folks. The secret ingredient was all mine. <laughs> the not so secret ingredient. <laughs> well, that can stay in there because that's just mostly. There's a okay. few that's onions. Taken off the heat now, guys. Take that off and put that and in the uh, jug for gravy. If Lee takes that off, we've got the hot plate on there now. Ooh. That's, nah, that's not. Should we probably just pour that into the jar? Oh my gosh, I've just moved it away. <laughs> She's been a flawless crap. Well, I've not got enough space. Well, I have, but. What, a whole naughty bench? I know, yeah. But nowhere Look to put that. a dirty spoon. Got a bit excited, went over the edge. I'm just going to put the bell end on top again, just to keep the heat in uh -uh. here, because otherwise it's going to start getting cold. And once Lee's got the old pastry sorted, we'll stick it in my dome. <laughs> right, I'll just cut it slightly bigger. That wasn't very straight. <laughs> and we can even kind of let it sink slightly onto the, onto there. This is a bit of a cheating pie because I like a pastry on the bottom. That's a proper pie. But this isn't a proper pie. <laughs> well, why did you put some on the bottom then? Professional opinion. Because you didn't want me to. Hmm. Yeah. Paul's just said I've got to make a leaf for the top. Well, it's got to be decorative, <laughs> hasn't it? Well, yes. We made all this effort. I haven't got a rolling pin out here, so... Oh dear, I'll just cut the leaf. It, don't look, it looks like a fish. <laughs> it was supposed to be a penis. What's it? But I'm not as good at drawing penises as you. 
come off to do a penis <laughs> print run. I am a good penis artist. <laughs> Was it a piss art? <laughs> I get mixed up between the two. <laughs> anyway, let's get this um, pie on the go. Oh, Ooh, don't do me milk. Let's see what happens, everybody. Mm -hmm. Oh dear, one of my testicles falling off. No, you, you milk on my penis. <laughs> You just know we can never ever be serious. It's, that's not a good penis. And it's not, it doesn't look like a penis at all. I mean, are them little things I that think excuse right. for ball sacks? Are they balls? Well, no, only because I had a bit extra, so I put them on. I mean, if they're balls, right? No. Well, that's no, a really there. fat penis. <laughs> and really misshapen. It does look like a fish, like you said. <laughs> right, I'm going to anyway. put some foil over that to keep that warm. Oh, oh, oh. I'm going to put them in. Oh, 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 oh. This is confusing, isn't it? Anyway, there we go. Another half hour or so, we'll see what happens. Bye. Play? Yes. What are you doing? I'm doing my jam labels. Is that for tomorrow's vlog? Yes. Mm. <laughs> I think we're pretty much getting there. The pace was taking longer than we thought, but, mm. you know, it is what it is. But well, we thought we'd get our Christmas lights out. It suddenly got dark, didn't it, Lee? <laughs> Alexa suddenly jumped on my cushion. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I think we're just about done. So um, Lee's going to serve up her pie. Well, our pie, look at that. It looks good, doesn't it? Mm, I don't know if I'm going to serve this. <laughs> With a spoon. <laughs> With the spoons. Oh, hi. The second bit is always better than the first because you can kind of get hold of it better. Let me tell you, folks, this smells amazing. I'm not quite sure the pastry got as browned as I'd have liked it, mm. but I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, Lee got some nasty stuff for hers. She's got some beans. Homegrown runner beans, so not Yeah, nasty. but still grim. Not grim. All we want to know is how does your pie taste? That's <laughs> neat. <laughs> I mean, this has been a good old cook, hasn't it, for a long time, so hopefully it's lovely and tender and lovely. Loud, because we can't hear you. Mm, very lovely. Mm, beautiful. Is it beautiful? Seriously. It's gorgeous. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, amazing. Really rich. Rich flavour. Mm, lovely. I'm going to have a taste now, everybody. To be fair... That is beautiful. <laughs> now seriously, I taste a little bit of the pastry because I know this is probably should have been done a bit longer. I don't know. Well, it's fine. It's good. It's just yeah, all right. Mm. That's all right. Yeah, it just looks a bit anemic. Yeah. It's enough. Is that like a short Irishman anemic? I'm impressed. I think we've excelled again. Mm. Honestly, do. Anyway, fabulous. <laughs> I'm really tired now. <laughs> but as we close this vlog for today, thank you for watching. Thanks for getting this far. Uh, please like and subscribe. Tell all your friends and all that. Palava. And just like to say, we will see you tomorrow at the same time. Or see you same time tomorrow. See, I'm so tired, I didn't get it right. But you didn't live on a wonderful our dinner. I'm was. sorry. See, I knew I'd forget something. Our dinner was delicious. Delicious. It so, was yeah, really I'm good. so full now. Yes, it was very rich with all the flavours. In my class. So, uh, <laughs> we're rich in life, darling. Indeed. We definitely are. 
so yes it was very lovely very delicious no it's i need a nap we'll see you at the same <laughs> time tomorrow everybody <laughs> see you at the same time tomorrow bye Good night. bye